right, we're here at Tyrell Basin Ski and Snowboard Area, and today we're playing disc golf on a temporary course that was just put in for the weekend. Actually, just Sunday. All right, so this is kind of a one-time deal. They just put the course in today, just temporary course, and there was a doubles event this morning. I think there's about 100 people out here. Um, the course is built on a on a, on a ski slope, so there's 18 holes out here, and there's a lot of up, down, you know, left, right type of shots, and it's really a uh, well thought out course design. You have a marker. This is towards the end of the day of the first annual Tyrol Basin Fall Fling. Um, everybody seems to have loved the course. Uh, couldn't have asked for a nicer day. Mother Nature provided us with a perfect canvas to enjoy ourselves. The, the initial design came from a couple of years of planning. Uh, you know, ever since I'd been working here since 2010, I've kind of been plotting things out in my mind about how the course would flow and. Uh, Really, it just had some basic ideas, but when I came out here this spring and was looking at it, it just all fell into place. It just, from hole one, starting over by Ben's Den and going up the hill, and, and just the natural flow of the course was very easy to, to, to design around. The, the hill lended itself in so many ways to such a very, uh, very, very nice design without a whole lot of work. And a lot of that is testament to, to all the work that Don and Sue and the, the Tyrell crew do out here to the place because it's, it's a very well kept piece of property. Um, the duster came in, touched up the design a little bit, and uh, this is what you have now. We had a little bit over 100 people today, which was, which was just over what we had anticipated. Couldn't have asked for a nicer day. Uh, and of course, big thanks to everybody who helped you know, put this together and it was a part of this. It was a lot of work and uh, it wasn't done by, by just one person. It was a lot of people that had their hands in it. So um, I hope we can do it again next year. Terrible Basin 2012, baby.